Welcome back to Pocket Mirror. We left off after running away from Harpe. Uh, I think she's dead, just like the other girl, Fleta. Now we're going to hop on this boat and see where it takes us. You know, I never got to check what that duck wanted. Well, it might have been a geese. Goose? Who knows? It's so cold. I don't want to be on my own. What? There's no need to be alone. I don't know who I am, or even my name. Perhaps she has the answer. What is this? Perhaps even you have the answer. I'm scared. I don't want to go on. I'm scared of the answer. The truth is looking near. Perhaps even nearer than you'd like to admit. Why me? Why are all? None of this has to do with me. None of this is our fault. And yet here you are. It's not too late to go back now. There are choices to be made. What can I do for them? What could they want from me? I wonder. What could you ever want from them? I just want to live. All right. Here we are. I wonder what our nameless protagonist thinks about what just happened. Where am I? Oh, she didn't even notice. Let's just keep walking forward. Are we in a worn down castle? What are these? A circus? Hey, it's that doll again. <laughs> hey, wait, come back. Exactly. We found the doll. It's hanging from nowhere. Okay, let's not pull the rope. <laughs> it's been a while since I died. Thank goodness I saved. No, I don't think I will. Then where do I go now? Hmm. I am speed. Maybe the pocket mirror will show me the way. No, it doesn't. Ah, you have to run away. Just what happened? Exactly what you think happened. How does it feel to be this beloved? Hooray, we get to go to a circus. I hope we don't. I don't know. I have to meet Lizette. I must be brave. Run. The music's become eerie, just keep running. Hello, pumpkin. Oh, it doesn't have a mouth. <laughs> Did it just... Maybe I could carve its face out.
Didn't I get a pair of scissors? Or did I use them to open something? Maybe I need to go back and grab a pair of scissors. Ah, yes. I wonder what hurt us. Hello, Mr. Pumpkin. Let's give you a face. Okay, seems I need to be right here. Let's see. No, that feels a hundred times better. Mr. Pumpkin, what are you doing in a place like this? I'm just waiting for the show to start. It sure took you a long time to get here, didn't it? What do you mean? I don't know. What do you want me to mean? Anyway, do me a favor, will you? What is it? There's something I want to show you. Won't you take us both there? I can't walk, you see. I don't know if... Great, so let's get going. She is... She really is eager to meet you, huh? How does it feel to be this famous? You're so bland. What are you... Right, just hurry up. Okay. It's so dark here. Leave it to me. Ah, sweet. Thank you, Mr. Pumpkin. No problem. You won't be thanking me later, believe me. What do you mean? Come now, you can stop faking it. What? <laughs> You're not gonna be thanking me in a second. If that scared you, then just wait till you meet her. I mean what I meant, and there's nothing else I can mean other than what I meant. You know, you're a really good pumpkin, not gonna lie. Run. You're not the most interesting of people, let me tell you that. You keep saying that. See? Absolutely terrible. Understand what you're talking about. I'm so lost and alone. Please don't tease me anymore. That's not... <laughs> I want to throw this pumpkin. <laughs> it knows too much. Just keep running. <laughs> Throw the pumpkin. <coughs> now that was fun, wasn't it? No, no it wasn't. Where are we? You wouldn't know even if I told you. You never know anything, do you? Isn't it time for you to remember? Remember what? This reality doesn't belong to you anymore, miss. You're far from being the only one looking for answers. Did we just throw the pumpkin? <laughs> oh dear. My daughter throwing an unsightly tantrum due to a childish comment her brother made. She was presenting a speech to a crowd at a same particular event. Ah, the, the plot is thickening. I couldn't recognize my own daughter. She had never shown this kind of behavior before. 
Chimist. But are you really awake? No, we haven't met Lizette yet. Ooh, a mirror. In jail? Where have you been? I was worried about you. I'm so glad you're here. Are you alright, Inja? Yes, I'm fine, but what happened? I just... Everything just happened so fast, I'm still, I'm feeling confused. We have time, Inja. Do you want to talk about it? It's about Harpe. She shattered. There was nothing else I could have done. I just... Isn't that how it was supposed to be? Inja. I understand it's hard, but you can forget the reason why you're here. I know, but to me, Harpe was... Let us forget about Harpe for now. I'm being harsh, but we have better things to focus on now. I understand. Please. I understand. Please find your way out of there as soon as you can. You have to come to me. We need to be reunited before it's too late. But wait. Oh, cool. We're tied up to a chair. Dear. Was that this time for sure? I will finally take your head. Oh, dear. I have to perform this lady? Aren't you hysterical? I know I am. I've been waiting for this moment for so long. For so long. It's been so long, so long, so long. Please, I'm just trying to... Hmm, what is it now? Are you scared? Please. Shut up. You're finally mine, Missy. Sleeping maiden of horrors. I've waited all this time just to shatter you. Can I run away? Seems not. Is that... Is that her pay? To the right? Or... No. Give it to me. No. No? We'll see about that. Why are you doing this? Aren't you the same as Arpe and Fleta? The same as those failures? You flatter me, Missy. Admit it. I was the only one who ever gave you what you needed most. What you wanted most. Okay, so she's definitely not uh, evil. I'm done with this farce. It's time for you to shatter as well, Miss Goody Two Shoes. <laughs> you know who deserves it most, don't you? It's no use denying it now. No. Give it to me and I'll put an end to all this. Isn't that what you always wanted? Stop it. <laughs> don't listen to anything she says. Wow, is Angel bad too? <laughs> Reflections of the same mirror. <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Let us go, please. Us? <laughs> so that's how it is. Get away from her. Get away from- Get away from me right now, you fiend. <laughs> Don't you dare get You don't have the right to do this to us. All of this is your fault. <laughs> you haven't changed in the least, have you? This has always been a petty game for you. Always. It's time to face it, Missy. There's no place for you here. You're no longer needed. You don't get it, do you? All of this is your fault. They wouldn't have shattered it if it weren't for the likes of you. That's not true. That's it. Keep on denying it.
Is she the one who shattered the other two characters? How do you know my name? I asked you a question. How do you know my name? I remembered your name, was that? You filthy liar. No, was that? I just... Wait, was that... I just want to understand you. Am I alive? Can I walk on the ta- oh, I can't walk on the table. Oh dear. Our supposed ally is gone. Is anyone there? Come, come closer. Who's there? Don't be afraid now. Come, I'm waiting for you. What can we? Yeah. What are we missing anyway? <laughs> it seems like we're a bad guy, so's Lizette and everyone else. Maybe the protagonist has depression or something. Oh dear. I don't... I don't like this. <laughs> Splish and a splash. Yep, keep going to the water. Hmm, we can't even look back. Oh cool, candles covered in blood. Crawl all you want. We have a job to do. It's all right to be scared. We need to get out of here. You don't want to be here? Too bad. This is how games develop. I don't want to wake up. So is this really all in your head? All you do is hide. Exactly, we need to stop hiding. You filthy coward. You have no right to be here. Get out. Exactly! Yeah. Do you like crying on your owns that much? No, I, I didn't mean to cry. You never mean anything, do you? Do you? I do, I do, but you just need to relive, believe in yourself for once. Is that, is that meant to be Fleta? I don't know what to do. Harpe. Remember, my girl, what have you come here to do? I have to keep going.
Yes. Let's save. Who's there? Let there be light. Is someone there? Please heat me. You, Lizette? No, I'm. I'm here to find out who I am. I'm not Lizette. Lizette. Forgive me. Give me. Give it to me. It's just as yours as it is mine. Pocket. No. Give me what's mine. You just won't admit it, will you? Lizette, it's time you stop playing games. I can't give you the pocket mirror. Oh dear. I feel like I'm gonna have to run for my life. Hello, clown. Just keep running. <laughs> Hello, tomato. They're chasing us. Go through the door. Run. Oh no, it seems we were captured again. What's this? Lost in the corridor is a purity as a soul whose ambition is nothing short of grand. Torn by disdain, blinded by dim whispers. Wrath and sorrow take her by the hand. Was that? I meant Harpe. Left to wander in uncharted waters, grasping at the last drops of hope, mercilessly torn, an entity left in tatters, with nothing left but a dreaded envelope. Guess we can't get that wrong, can we? I had no what no idea what we were doing there. Ah, uh, we gotta go through this again. That's lame. That's really lame. Let's get back to that room, shall we? All right, we're back here. Throw me into the room so I may try to answer these puzzles correctly. What's this? All right. This is the first time I actually could predict what this was for. Left to wander in uncharted waters, grasping at the last drops of hope.
I'll just get my pocket mirror back. Clad in flames of passion, contr eh, contradictory to one's greed for pleasure, to stain one's soul as in disdain fashion, in a deluge which knows no measure. Rage. Unending rage. Now, what do I do with them? Items. Place the shard facing left. Ah, oh, G purple. Grieve tears trickle down fair skin, hurt akin to overwhelming madness, possession, passion, and haunting malice, clad in a certain girl's injustice. Gee, a save box of happiness. Well, we'll leave off for here. I have a feeling the next episode is going to be the last one of this game. I hope you have enjoyed today so far. If you did, don't forget the like button. If you didn't, thanks for watching. And I will see you in the next one. As always, goodbye.